Hey everyone, it's Anne Marie from Scrap Doll 7 Creations, and this morning I'm coming to share this other sign that I made um, early this morning. I started it late last night, and then uh, I got up early and uh, wanted to finish it up. Um, so it's this Christmas stocking, um, and it's a wood it's a wood piece, and I got it at Hobby Lobby yesterday. Um, you know, it's just a plain wood piece, and I just took. Um, my pattern paper and I just traced around the shape I cut it out um, glued it on uh, and then I you know I took these uh, little wood gingerbreads so that I painted up um, with my it's, uh, folk art cinnamon matte paint okay this is the color I've been using for all of my gingerbreads when I paint them up it's a really nice um, gingerbready color <laughs> Okay, um, and again, um, just like the last one I did, I um, took my uh, uh, Posca white paint marker, um, and I got these on Amazon. These are the thin-tipped ones, and I just went around each gingerbread and just made little, um, you know, stitches around um, for both the boy and the girl. Um, for the little boy, I just put this bow tie here and then I use these um, red pearl um, embellishments that I had in my stash. Um, I uh, stamped the face with, actually it's still on my block. <laughs> um, hold on. Uh, yeah, with this face here and that comes from the Peachy Keen yeah, Peachy Keen Assorted Gingerbread Faces Stamp Set. Okay, so I used um, that one right there. Okay, uh, PK2535. Um, if you're interested in buying those, okay. Um, yeah, and then I just, I took some of this um, wide, and I have it right here, this wide, um, eyelet lace that I got at Hobby Lobby. Okay, and some other um, eyelet lace that I had in my stash. And I just glued it on the, the top part. Um, I have this um, red pom-pom trim that I put all the way around it. I had this um, felt uh, poinsettia flower in my stash. And I've had them for so long. I've had them for a long time. And I, you know, Finally, I uh, got around to using it. <laughs> okay, and then I just took that pom-pom trim and went all the way around the stocking. Okay, to give it some added dimension there. Um, and then here's the girl. Okay, and uh, I just took some of this red trim I had in my stash and made a skirt for her. And put some other little thin um, red trim for like a band. Again, use those red pearl gems for buttons. And then I just took some of my lace and I cut it apart and made like a little collar, like um, <coughs> like this bottom part. I just took a piece and cut it to make a collar. Um, yeah. So, and then um, I did the same on the back. I just um, added some pattern paper went around with the pom-pom trim and then I added um, a poinsettia flower there okay I actually I put it there because it, the <laughs> there was a little bit of a boo-boo there so I thought well I'll just cover it up with that big poinsettia um, flower um, but yeah okay so I thought it came out pretty cute. Now what I'll probably do is, um, you know, I'll just add a hanger on the back. Um, I'll probably just, um, you know, glue um, a button um, maybe at the top here. Maybe I'll do that. I'll add a, a little button up there and make a, um, a tie so that you can hang this up okay 
It's a little hard to stand this guy up here because he's, uh, <laughs> kind of have to stand it like that. Okay. And then this is my other, um, sign that I made yesterday. Right there. <laughs> okay. With they, and they have different little different faces. Oh, I forgot to put the cheeks on these guys. <laughs> I'll have to go back and do that and add little pink cheeks. Okay. Yeah, so um, I just wanted to come on quickly and, and just share this uh, um, this stocking that I just finished up um, before I go have breakfast with my dad. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Um, uh, if you... Um, aren't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Um, I love it when I have new followers. I uh, just want to welcome everybody that's new. Um, and uh, I will see you guys later. Bye.